Here's the deal. A company called Boston Dynamics, under contract with a federal agency that does research for the Defense Department, built a robot called Atlas. This is really a, basically a test bed. It's a robot that is to be used to learn how to teach robots to do a variety of things needed to deal with emergencies. First responder robots could be used in every situation from uh, dealing with a fire in a warehouse to, to somehow trying to get control of an out of control nuclear power plant. The idea is you send a robot to do the jobs that humans can't do because they're too dangerous. These robots are going to be able to climb into a truck and drive themselves into a danger zone. They'll be able to use axes and hammers and power drills. They'll be able to walk up stairs. They'll be able to open doors. That's the general idea. At MIT and these other researchers, the goal is to write software that will enable Atlas to carry out these very dangerous and complex tasks. Along the way, the scientists and engineers are getting constant reminders of how really complicated everyday actions can be. It's going to take a long time before a robot can be trained to do these kinds of tasks, but there's no question that it is going to be possible.